Good afternoon, everybody. Welcome, welcome, welcome to Home Choir. Uh, we're here for another week, of course, with some fantastic music. Today is Songs of the Land, because we've got lots going on around the world. It's uh, it's Burns Night tomorrow, as far as I can tell. Jill, do correct me if I'm wrong. And then it's Australia Day on Wednesday. So we're going to have a couple of Australian songs. We're going to sing Loch Lomond as well, as lo along with a couple of other great cheery folk songs. I do have to warn you, ladies and gentlemen, today's broadcast may contain traces of banjo. Quite a lot of banjo, actually. So consider yourselves warned, and you're all very, very welcome this afternoon. Uh, now, here in Bristol, for those of you keeping track, it is grey, it is soggy, it is cold. It's January in the West Country. Several of you are saying it's glorious where I am. Well, please do share the sunshine. Pop it up here in the comments. You never know. It might have an effect on the sky but I doubt it. And lots of people, I just have to thank those of you who were at the Choir of the Earth concert yesterday. I'm so glad we had such a good turnout. So glad you folks all enjoy, enjoyed it. What fantastic music. And uh, for those of you, again, uh, who are followers of Choir of the Earth, you will know already that this evening, in a few short hours, I am starting an incredible piece of music by this chap here, by Wolfie, the Great Mass in C minor. I cannot wait. It's just one of my all-time favourite pieces. I've never actually gotten to conduct it before. I've sung in it. I was obsessed with it for quite a long time. But from, from when I first sang it in 1999, I mean, it was just an amazing experience. Can't wait to conduct it and teach it to everyone today. And of course, you'll all have seen, those of you that are on the Choir of the Earth website, that there's the new Russian Wonders course, uh, which has just gone live today. That's not taking place till May, but... Uh, those of you that didn't take part in Russian Wonders in the summer and kicked yourselves, now's your chance, okay? The Tchaikovsky alone, amazing. Uh, so bear with me, everyone. As always, I've just got to run through the quick sound checks. It's very, very important when I'm doing these broadcasts between the various channels so that everything's set up. So first of all, do we have the magnificent acoustic of Patchway Cathedral today? Shall we see? <laughs> yes. Piano is working as well. That's good. Now, see, this is why we do the sound checks because my buttons are all set up here for the Mozart C minor mass, which is great. That's not what we've got planned for today on Home Choir. Those of you who are looking forward to the classical repertoire, of course, Wednesday is our classical day, and this week we're in the company of Mr. Vivaldi. But more on that in a minute. Uh, let's just check. We should have should be coming around the mountain. Oh yes, as I say, more than a little trace of banjo. Uh, here's Oh Susanna. See what I mean? <laughs> the new one today is Click Go The Shears for everyone in Aust. Just to warn you, cracking tune, really significant earworm. I'm not kidding. I recorded it on Saturday and you know what it did, ladies and gentlemen? It knocked that Bond song that I did on Friday. It knocked that completely out of my head and has replaced it. So uh, if you've had the Bond song going round your head very long, don't worry, it won't be there long. It'll be replaced by a song all about sheep shearing. So there we go. Uh, and Loch Lomond. Do we have Loch Lomond? Oh, yes. Lovely. By yon bonny banks and yon bonny breeze. Let me put that in there. Let's just set the fade appropriately for that. Marvellous. So everything seems to be in order. Piano's a bit echoey. Let's do something about that. Right. So uh, Anna sent me through the birthdays. And so we have two birthdays tomorrow. We have Jane's birthday tomorrow and Yuko's birthday tomorrow. So we shall sing happy birthday to both of you very very shortly but first of all let me welcome all of you who are here live and chatting away and of course we've got lots of people who watch us later on on catch up and just thank you to everyone who watches our broadcasts please feel free to send them to anyone you think would enjoy a good sing a good laugh and some good music and to those of you watching live but not necessarily here in the chat hello to all of you as always a very good morning to helen and bill helen thank you so much for all of your emails regarding the mozart immensely helpful. Helen, everyone has sent me several emails just stuffed full of really useful information, basically um, record liner notes 
on the C minor mass. So when I appear particularly knowledgeable about the Mozart later on, you know exactly why. Thank you, Helen. Lots of love to you. Uh, thank you to uh, everyone who's been sending in emails and, uh, and some wonderful pictures, wonderful images. People have been meeting up and singing together. Absolutely fantastic. Um, let me finish my hellos. Hello to Sally and Annie. Hello to Maureen. Hello to Val. Hello to dear Kit Kat, who's not very well. And she's asked me, everyone, those of you expecting to Zoom today, I'm afraid she's really not feeling very well. So there will be no Zoom uh, organised by Kit Kat after the rehearsal stay. Okay? Thank you very much, everyone. Um, and hello to Katie in Thornbury and everyone else. And then everyone here. What a fantastic turnout. Let me just click on my list click go the list boys click 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 and i shall start by saying good talk to albert hello albert hello to alison hola to anna and hola jota hello to angela hello barbara hello to barbara and barbara three barbaras we are truly blessed it's lovely to have all three of you with us hello to carol and bumble hello to carolyn on the island hello to kathy hello to dear christine and terry hello to christine and peter and to christine and malcolm three barbaras three christines couldn't ask for more. Hello to Cynthia. Cynthia, thank you for your lovely photo uh, of you. I think it was Jen and a couple of other choristers who met up to sing Mr. Tango last week. Looks like a fantastic occasion. And I'm very jealous because I so want to sing Mr. Tango. What a piece. Uh, who else is here? Hello to Dave and Jill. Hello to Diane. Good morning to Dorothy. Hello, Eileen. Uh, hello to Elizabeth. Hello to Emma. A very good afternoon to Fiona and Myrick. Hello to Fiona. Hello to Gaya. Hello, Jill. Hello, Gina. Hello, Gina. Hello, Glennis. Hello to Jane. Hello, Jane. Hello, Janet. Hello, Jean. Hello, Jill. Good morning, Julie. Good morning, Kathy. Hello, Lisa. Uh, oh, now I need to start clicking because the list is so long. So many people. Uh, bonjour, Lorraine. Hello to Linda. Hello to Michael. Hello, Nicola. Hello, Nikki. Guten Tag, Norb. Norb, thank you for your email. I really... I can't thank you enough. That was a lovely email to get. Really appreciate it. Uh, hello to Patricia. Guten Tag, Ruth. Hello, Sandra. Hello, Shan. Hello, Sue. Hello, Susanna. All right, Terry. And hello, Virginia. There we are. And I'm sure there's more people joined us. I hate to miss anyone off, but that's all I can see at the moment. And it's just great to have you all with us. Fabulous. Lots of people wishing lots of love to Kit Kat. Kit Kat, if you are watching... Just hope you feel much, much better soon. Sorry you're not feeling well. And everyone here, I'm sure, echoes that. So, everyone, how are we doing? Quick sip of coffee. Tell me how you're doing. Great stuff. Okay, those of you going through a tough time, we're here for you. All right, pop up in the comments. Let us know how you're doing. Virtual hugs abound. Those of you having a nice day, fabulous long may it continue um i have been busy today getting everything ready for the launch of the mozart having a long chat with mr mark strawn bem about some fantastic projects coming up this year and there's more besides i mean just from a home choir point of view there's some big things on the horizon which i'm looking forward to telling you about very shortly but we have some singing to do in the meantime so do enjoy this afternoon session everyone uh we've got some really really good fun songs as i say including lots and lots of banjo so don't say you weren't warned uh, do make sure you've got everything you need for the session most importantly will be a drink of water mine is down here have a quick sip marvelous um do feel free to chat away come and join us in the live chat if you're here live later on if uh, the live chat's not running because it won't be um consider leaving us a comment underneath don't forget the thumbs up to say you like the broadcast folks and please do subscribe if you've not yet done so we are inching our way. We're very close to 2,900 subscribers, which is ever so close to 3,000. I'd love to get to 3,000 by, by the time the choir turns two. So that gives us six weeks. Let's see if we can do it, folks. All right. If you've not subscribed yet, why not make today the day? So uh, we need to get started. You know what to do. Those of you that are regular members of the choir, we're going to wave our fingers at the screen and we need to make the all important sound or I can't change the screen. All right. So everyone at home, everyone, here we go. flawless a very very good afternoon home choir and welcome to another week of fantastic music uh, we've got some gorgeous pieces uh, in the bag we've got the vivaldi coming up on wednesday we've got a fun friday to remember uh, which we're calling uplifted i've been writing the song this morning it's based on a ringtone called uplift and um well let's just say it's it's very much a, a worthwhile and a worthy successor to the silly songs we've had so far uh, there's some ukulele in there, there's some glockenspiel, 
you'll see the rest and hear it on Friday. But let's see what we've got coming up today. As I was just saying in my little preamble there, there's a lot going on around the world at the moment. We've got Australia Day on Wednesday. We have Burns Night tomorrow. So as a little tribute to both of those wonderful nations, we are going to be spending some time in the company of some of their music. We'll start in a moment, though, with a couple of American songs. She'll be coming around the mountain when she comes. And oh, Susanna. Uh, we'll follow that with a new song today, which is Click Go The Shears. And you can see here the image uh, that I found today very much sums up uh, the, the, the meaning of that song. Then we'll sing Loch Lomond. Uh, for those of you north of the border and finish with Waltzing Matilda. So all really, really good tunes. And to warn you, click go the shears will really get stuck in your head. It really will. <laughs> but let's quickly look at what we've got coming up for the rest of the week. So on Wednesday, as I've said, Propter Manium Glorium from Vivaldi's Gloria. Fantastic piece. It's a fugue. So this is where one part comes in singing a line and then another one comes in singing pretty much the same line, but a few notes away. And they all work together. Uh, it's a great little piece. It's only short, perfect for learning at a lunchtime. Some of you know it already, but you haven't sung our version. So come along and join us on Wednesday for Bite Size Baroque. And then Fun Friday, as I've said, Uplifted. Uh, we're going to sing some cheery numbers and the new mobile masterpiece. On Sunday, we're going to sing two movements from Vivaldi's Gloria. That is Et in Terra Pax and Props of Manum Gloriam. The first movement of Vivaldi's Dixit Dominus and a couple of spirituals as well. Uh, remember to please sign up for our email newsletter if you haven't done so. Uh, Anna works really hard at making sure you have everything you need in one place. And uh, if you sign up for it, it's of course absolutely free. And we will only email you once a week. Uh, so do consider doing that if you haven't already done so. Let's get started, everyone. As I said, we do have a couple of birthdays today. Please ascend. Let's see if I can get through the warm-up and include the birthdays rather than stop halfway through the first song and remember to do it. So <laughs> let's start today, everyone, by just taking a nice deep breath and sighing. <sighs> Splendid. And again, nice deep breath and the bigger sigh. <sighs> Fabulous. And just roll your shoulders around. I see you've been joined by a few more people. Hello to Hillary. Lovely to see you. I do hope you enjoy this afternoon. So rolling those shoulders around a few times and then roll them back the other way. Fabulous. Be gentle with yourselves. Some of you have already had most of the first day of the week. Those of you here in the UK, nearly through your first day back of the week. So get rid of any tension you've built up. And if it's the first thing in the morning where you are, well, let's start the week off properly, feeling nice and relaxed. Bring your shoulders up, please, everyone. Deep breath and breathe out and let those shoulders fall. <sighs> Excellent. Well done, you. Okay, let's let the head gently tilt to one side. Feel the stretch along the long side. Very nice. To the middle and the other way. Again, just gently stretching these muscles out. Wonderful. And to the middle and forwards, please. And to the middle. And then just repeat that. Whichever way you went first, go that way again. Just a little bit further if you can. Wonderful. To the middle and the other way. Just stretch those muscles very gently. Don't be too harsh. To the middle and forwards. Great stuff. And then within those three movements, everyone, left, right and forwards, just let your head very gently roll around. Fabulous. Okay, splendid. Let's do a bit of humming and ya 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 and ma 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 and so on. And then we will remember to sing the birthdays because it's Jane and Yuko's birthday tomorrow. <laughs> let's see, shall we? Right, uh, let's hum together. Nice long notes. Here we go. Mm, up a semitone. Mm, now, mm, for November. Much 
indeed, ladies and gentlemen. And we have two birthdays. I didn't forget. It is Jane's and Yuko's birthday tomorrow. So to both of you, thank you for being wonderful home choristers and for all the support you show us. And we are delighted to sing you happy birthday in advance of your special day, which is tomorrow. So everyone, to Jane and Yuko, after two, one, two. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to Jane and Yuko. Happy birthday to you. Many happy returns of the day to both of you. And remember, if you are watching and you think, but it's my birthday and you don't know, remember, sign up for the email newsletter. Tell us when your birthday is. And Anna, who always does a lovely job uh, of collating this for me, will tell me when it's your birthday and we'll sing for you. We do have a couple of birthdays later this week. Uh, I believe it's Linda's birthday on the 28th and it's Teresa's birthday on the 30th. But we will sing happy birthday for you when it's nearer the time. So everyone, some great music starting right now. We've got our first song, which is She'll Be Coming Around the Mountain When She Comes. I warned you that there would be banjo in this broadcast, and I'm a man of my word. You can see here in the background, though, I've been quite busy with the stringed instruments. So I've got my lovely 12 string here, which has been without a couple of strings for a little while. But the strings finally arrived. Obviously, my gorgeous cantalet, which I love. And this beautiful instrument, which will be making its home choir debut on Friday. Uh, this, of course, is an a ukulele, or as it should be properly called an ukulele, okay? So in case anyone out there's going, I play the uke. You don't play the uke, you play the uke, the ukulele. And we'll be hearing from that on Friday during the song Uplifted. And uh, just to say, it'll probably be making an appearance uh, in the future as well. But for today, let's bring the words back on screen. She'll be coming around the mountain when she comes. Feel free to stick in any interjections you like. Have fun with this one, folks. Here we go. Here comes the banjo. <laughs> Don't say I didn't warn you. Deep breath. Here we go. She'll be coming round the mountain when she comes. She'll be coming round the mountain when she comes. She'll be coming round the mountain. She'll be coming round the mountain. She'll be coming round the, the mountain when she comes. Everyone. Singing I I yippee yippee I yee Singing I I yippee yippee I Singing I I yippee I I yippee I I yippee yippee I She'll be driving six white horses when she comes <laughs> She'll be driving six white horses when she comes She'll be driving six white horses Driving six white horses She'll be driving six white horses when she comes Singing I I yippee yippee I, singing I I yippee yippee I, singing I I yippee I I yippee I I yippee yippee I. It's lunchtime. Oh, we'll all have chicken and dumplings when she comes. Oh, we'll all have chicken and dumplings when she comes. Yum yum. Oh, we'll all have chicken and dumplings. All have chicken and dumplings. All have chicken and dumplings when she comes. Singing I I yippee yippee I yee Singing I I yippee yippee I Singing I I yippee I I yippee I I yippee yippee I We'll be singing hallelujah when she comes We'll be singing hallelujah when she comes We'll be singing hallelujah We'll be singing hallelujah We'll be singing hallelujah when she comes Singing I I yippee yippee I Singing I I yippee yippee I Singing I I yippee I I yippee I I yippee one more time singing I I yippee yippee I singing I I yippee yippee I singing I I yippee I I yippee I I yippee yippee I Well sung everybody I wouldn't mind chicken and dumplings at this point. 
Oh dear. Did you catch... It was a, it was a very subtle little nod to uh, Handel's Messiah in there. You, you might have missed it. <laughs> oh dear. Remember later on I shall be rehearsing the Mozart Great Mass in C minor, everyone. A, an, a, an essentially monolithic piece of classical music. Um, I'm not sure they'd let me do it if they saw that this broadcast, but anyway, too late now. Uh, hope you enjoyed that, everyone, and we're going to take another step uh, towards the south of America, and we're going to sing uh, Oh, Susanna. Now, I know we've got Susanna here uh, in the comments. My sister is named Susanna, and I grew up singing this one, and so I learned very early on not to sing it in any kind of mocking way to somebody called Susanna, or frankly, I'll get a clout round the back of the head. Um, so our version is good, solid fun, and I do hope you'll all enjoy seeing it with me. Here is Oh Susanna, and I don't have a banjo, but I do have a ukulele. So here we go. <laughs> Deep breath. Well, I come from Alabama with a banjo on my knee. I'm bound for Louisiana. My true love for to see It rained all night the day I left the weather it was dry The sun so hot I froze to death Susanna don't you cry I said oh Susanna now don't you cry for me For I come from Alabama with a banjo on my knee I had a dream the other night when everything was still I dreamed I saw my girl Suzanne, she was coming round the hill Now the buckwheat cake was in her mouth, the tear was in her eye I said I come from Dixieland, Susanna don't you cry I said oh Susanna now don't you cry for me For I come from Alabama with a banjo on my One more time Oh, Susanna, now don't you cry for me Well, I come from Alabama with a banjo on my knee Very nice. Ladies and gentlemen, well sung. And lots of love to everyone out there. If you're Sue, Susan, Susanna, that was just for you. All right, well done. Try not to get the ukulele caught in the headphones. How's everyone doing? Fabulous. <laughs> Lots of people talking about haggis. We'll come back to that in a minute. Because, of course, it's Burns Night tomorrow. So it's uh, the tra tra traditional dish, and correct me if I'm wrong here, Jill, is haggis with neeps and tatties. Okay? Now, the neeps and tatties, I am absolutely up for. Haggis, still working on it. <laughs> Although we do have a haggis, which, which somebody sent us. You know who you are, Jill. Uh, so that's going to be on the menu tomorrow. I suspect that uh, Anna will eat the vast majority of it. I will certainly have some. The children will... <laughs> don't like it. Let's see. Let's see, though. All right. I think maybe Bob will try it. Let's give it a go. Anyway, everyone, it's time to move on to our new song today. You know us. We try and learn a new song every session, uh, certainly during the week. And this one is dedicated with lots of love to all of our Australian choristers, in particular to Jane and to Geoffrey, who come along on a Sunday morning when it's actually really quite late at night for them. And they'd be here live, but it's two o'clock in the morning where they are. So when you're watching this later on, lots of love to both of you and to everyone who joins us from down under, this one's for you. Now, this is an insanely catchy song everyone you should have the score in the description those of you that want to follow it i'm just going to bring it up on screen so i can see it as well um, now the version that we have uh there we go the version that i've shared today and thanks to vfmc.org.au um, for sharing this with us it has five verses we're missing out verse three uh we're just going to do verses one two four and five those of you following along on the song sheet okay so i'm going to give you a little introduction i'm going to teach you the verse then I'm going to teach you the chorus, then we'll sing those two, and then we'll sing the whole song. All right, but this is Click Go the Shears. Speaking of which, I should probably go and see the barber. Anyway. It goes. Out on the board the old shearer stands, grasping his shears in his thin bony hand. Fixed is his gaze on a bare-bellied yo. Glory if he gets a won't he make the ring a go. 
Okay, that's the verse. Let me teach you the first line. It's got that nice bouncy rhythm, that dotted rhythm. Out on the board, the old shearer stands. With me, everyone. Two, three, four. Out on the board, the old shearer stands. Fabulous. Next line. Grasping his shears in his thin bony hand. Everyone. Grasping his shears in his thin bony hand. Brilliant. Now, as always with these folk songs, not always, but often, the third line is the same as the first. Fixed is his gaze on a bare-bellied yo. Everyone, fixed is his gaze on a bare-bellied yo. Fabulous. And then the last line brings it home. Glory if he gets a won't he make the ring a go. Everyone, glory if he gets a won't he make the ring a go. Lovely. Let's sing the verse from the beginning. Let's have a bit of acoustic. Here's our uh, first verse. Out on the board, the old shearer stands, grasping his shears in his thin bony hand. Fixed is his gaze on a bare-bellied yo. Glory if he gets a won't he make the ring a go. Very nice, ladies and gentlemen. Now the chorus. This is the bit that's been stuck in my head all weekend. It goes, click go the shears, boys, click, click, click. Why does his blow and his hands move so quick? The ringer looks around and is beaten by a blow and curses the old snagger with the bare belly yo. All right, so let's break that down into individual lines. How are people doing in the comments? Excellent. Right, so click go the shears, boys. We can separate the clicks, obviously. Click, click, click. Don't sing it legato, it's not opera. Click, go the shears. Two, three, four. Click, go the shears, boys. Click, click, click. Very nice. Next line. Why does this blow and his hands move so quick? And why does this blow and his hands move so quick? And then the last line, actually rather sneakily is the same as the uh, verses the ringer looks around and is beaten by a blow and curses the old snagger with the bare belly yo let's sing together the ringer looks around everyone two three four the ringer looks around and is beaten by a blow and curses the old snagger with the bare belly yo there we go Okay, now Australian accents are not required unless you think you can get away with it. I'm going to have, a, I'm just going to sneak a little bit in here and there. I have for the last weeks. This I wasn't sure I was going to share this with you. I've become obsessed, and this is true. Anna will back me up with watching Australian gold and opal miners on YouTube. I mean, it's just it's, I just can't get enough. <laughs> I mean, there's some strange stuff on YouTube. I mean, just look. But yes, I've been obsessed. So uh, I've been brushing up. And uh, let's see how we've done. Let's sing. Everyone, click go the shears. And don't say I didn't warn you. This is very, very catchy. Here we go. And out on the board, the old shearer stands, grasping his shears in his thin, bony hand. Fixed is his gaze on a bare-bellied yo. Glory if he gets a won't he make the ring a go. Click. Go the shears, boys, click, click, click. Why does his blow and his hands move so quick? The ringer looks around and is beaten by a blow and curses the old snagger with the bare bellied yo. Well done, let's do the next verse. In the middle of the floor, in his cane bottom chair, sits the boss of the board with his eyes everywhere. Notes well each fleece as it comes to the screen, paying strict attention that is taken off clean. Click, go the shears, boys, click, click, click. Why does his blow and his hands move so quick? The ringer looks around and is beaten by a blow and curses the old snagger with the bare bellied yo. Let's do verse three. The colonial experienced man, he's there, of course, with his shiny leggings on, just off his horse. He gazes all around like a real connoisseur, scented soap and brilliant time smelling most peculiar. Click, go the shears, boys, click, click, click. Why does his blow and his hands move so quick? 
The ringer looks around and is beaten by a blow And curses the old snagger with his bare-bellied yo Last verse Shearing is all over and we've all got our checks Roll up your swag boys, we're off on the tracks the first pub we come to, it's there we'll have us free. And everyone that comes along, it's come and drink with me. Click, go the shears, boys, click, click, click. Why does his blow and his hands move so quick? The ringer looks around and is beaten by a blow and curses the old snagger with the bear one more time. Click, go the shears, boys, click, click, click. Why does his blow and his hands move so quick? The ringer looks around and is beaten by a blow and curses the old snagger with the bare belly yo. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that was Ripper and Bonza. Both of those official musical terms down under. Well done. That's such a good tune as well. I think I managed to say brilliant time. That's because I've been watching the producers recently. Brilliant team, obviously. <laughs> if you haven't seen the film of the producers with Nathan Lane and Matthew Broderick, it's absolutely brilliant. The time has come to be an Ar uh, to be a lover of the Argentine, to brush my hair down with Brilliantine, and gargle heavily with Lister, Ein. Just the best. Well done, everyone. Quick sip of drink. Now, how's the conversation about haggis going? Good, good, good. Oh, Anna's got the shopping list sorted. So it looks like we're going to have a fantastic Scottish dinner tomorrow. Can't wait, everyone. Can't wait. And let's sing Loch Lomond. Uh, we've been singing this one on the channel for a good long while. Gorgeous, gorgeous tune. And lots of love to everyone tomorrow up in Scotland for Burns Night. So everyone, get your haggis ready and let's sing Loch Lomond. Here we go. Nice deep breath. By on bonny banks and by on bonny braes, where the sun shines bright on Loch Lomond, where me and my true love were never want to be, on the bonny bonny banks on Loch Lomond, deep sides of Ben Lomond, where in Island hills we view, and the moon coming out in the gloaming. Oh, he'll tack the high road, and I'll tack the low road, and I'll be in Scotland afore ye, where me and my true love will never meet again on the bonny, bonny banks on Loch Lomond. Wildflowers spring and the wee birdies sing on the steep, steep side of Ben Lomond. But the broken hearted kens ne his second spring again, though the way full may cease frae their greeting. Oh, he'll tack the high road and I'll tack the low road. And I'll be in Scotland afore ye, where me and my true love will never meet again. On the bonny, bonny banks, on Loch Lots of love to everyone north of the border. Have a wonderful Burns night tomorrow. And uh, have, a, have a serving of haggis for me. <laughs> you can have mine. No, have a wonderful day tomorrow. Now, I see from the chat there was some buffering issues. Well, everything was all right at this end, so hopefully that won't affect the playback. I mean, sometimes the internet, as we know, is a law unto itself. Not much I can do about YouTube, but uh, if you hopefully I'll check back later on. That won't have affected the recording. And so if you missed a verse... 
can always rewind later on. Let's sing our last song today, everyone. And we're going to jump back down under for this one. Because as I've said, it's Australia Day. We've done lots of Scottish songs. We've done, in fact, I was thinking the other day, we've done songs in uh, uh, in Welsh, Japanese, French, German, Spanish. We have yet to do a Portuguese song, Anna, and I'll get to that. Uh, we've sung in various African languages. Uh, we, we need to do some songs in proper Gaelic. And uh, But, you know, we only actually, have, up until now, have done one Australian song. So today is writing that wrong. And I've been sent lots and lots of wonderful music, so don't worry. There's plenty of lovely languages still to learn. I do think Portuguese needs to jump to the top. Oh, Italian. We've sung in Italian as well. Cheers. We're going to finish today with waltzing, Matilda. And so make sure you've got your, your tucker bag ready. And uh, if you haven't had lunch, can I recommend uh, deep fried jumbuck? Okay, everyone. Let's sing. No, wrong key, England. Let's try it again. Can't get the staff, can you? Actually, I do have to tell you, before we sing, my, my mum, as you know, was a teacher, and she was teaching a class once uh, of, of youngsters. This is before I was born, so it's been the early 70s. And she taught them all about how the convicts were sent over to... Uh, Australia with P-O-M-E Prisoner of Mother England on the back that's why we're known as POMs and uh, a kid came in the next day she swears this true with P-O-M-E on the back and my mum says Prisoner of Mother England she said no Prisoner of Mrs England oh, Once a jolly swag man camped by a billabong under the shade of the coolie bar tree he sang as he watched and waited till his billy boiled Come a waltzing Matilda with me Waltzing Matilda, waltzing Matilda You'll come a waltzing Matilda with me He sang as he watched and waited till his billy boiled You'll come a waltzing Matilda with me Down came the jumbuck, down came the jumbuck To drink at the billabong Up jumped the swagman and grabbed him with glee He sang as he shoved that jumbuck in his tucker bag You'll come a waltzing Matilda with me Waltzing Matilda, waltzing Matilda You'll come a waltzing Matilda with me He sang as he shoved that jumbuck in his tucker bag You'll come a waltzing Matilda with me up rode the squatter, mounted on his thoroughbred. Up rode the troopers, one, two, three. Who's that jolly jumbuck you've got in your tucker bag? You'll come a waltzing Matilda with me. Waltzing Matilda, waltzing Matilda. You'll come a waltzing Matilda with me. Who's that jolly jumbuck you've got in your tucker bag? You'll come a waltzing Matilda with me. Now this is where it gets a bit sad, everyone. It's a folk song, so it's got to have a sad ending. Here we go. Up jumped the swagman and sprang into the billabong. You'll never catch me alive, said he. And his ghost may be heard as you pass beside that billabong. You'll come a waltzing Matilda with me. Ah, waltzing Matilda, waltzing Matilda. You'll come a waltzing Matilda with me. And his ghost may be heard as you pass beside that billabong. You'll come a waltzing Matilda with me. Again, Bonza and Ripper, well done, everyone. Well sung, and thank you for being here today to sing with all of us. This fantastic choir, which spreads out all around the world and brings people together. I'm really, really delighted to have so many of you singing with me. So join me on Wednesday for something completely different, as we'll be learning some classical music, in fact, some Baroque music, the wonderful Proptomanium Glorium from Vivaldi's Gloria. And if you are around this evening and you haven't signed up for the Mozart Great Mass in C minor with Cry of the Earth, there is still time, I promise you. It's the most fantastic piece of music. I have to say this quietly. I prefer it to the Requiem. <gasps> really. It's that good. It's absolutely astonishing. So do consider coming along to that. Otherwise, 
I will see you on Wednesday. Lots of love to all of you and do take care. Happy Australia Day to those of you down under and happy Burns Night for tomorrow, everyone north of the border. All the very best, folks. Take care. Bye-bye.